Hi, everyone. I hope that everybody that is in the wake of the storm is safe and sound right now. I am praying for all of you and hope that you do well. Hope we hear from you to know that you're doing well. I was out yesterday and today, and I have a few finds here. I'm going to go over them with you in a kind of an odd order here. First of all, this is my second Bath and Body Works haul. Just this one mahogany teakwood, high intensity. It's a full candle, never burnt. But the glass is broken. I'm going to cut it up. I have plans for that. And then today, my second Bath and Body Works haul. This one was really good. I have quite a few things. I have some aromatherapies. I have three of them. They're completely full. I have a cactus blossom that they tried to squeeze out into the bag, but it's mostly there. And I found the top and put it back on. I have a black cherry Merlot spray. It's full. A black cherry Merlot hand wash. It's full. I have a full hand sanitizer. And then I have some wallflowers. Now this is interesting. I have three regular ones. But I have this one here, which is a double wallflower, and it holds two. First time I've seen that, that's pretty cool. I also have a wallflower refill. This one is Wicked Apple, and it also is full. Now I've been having some a lot of broken candles and a lot of broken containers. I've got a raspberry mimosa. And this one is black cherry Merlot. So that's what I'm used to finding lately. But today was quite refreshing. I have written on canisters, but my glass is not broken. I have a champagne toast, which is almost a full candle. It's missing its wick. This one also is missing its wick. This one is pineapple mango. I have sun-kissed linen. which is halfway burned. That one is broken. And another full one without the wicks. This one is Black Cherry Merlot. They must have had something going on at the factory because there's no wicks on these. Then I have Lakeside Morning. Full candle, never burnt. Unbroken glass. I have eucalyptus, spearmint, half burnt. Again, without the wicks. I don't know if they're doing something at the candle store, but that's new. Hibiscus Waterfall, half burnt. Another full candle, never burnt. This one is Blackberry and Basil. 
Then I have a fresh fall morning, slightly burnt. I also have a couple jars, mahogany coconut, one wick. Smells pretty good. Another one, unbroken jar, sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Nice. Renew and refresh, full. And sugared lemon zest, full, never opened. Now I have, this is from yesterday's haul. I have this broken one, which is Autumn Adventure. Then I have a mahogany teak wood, brand new full, unbroken jar, sun kissed, brand new full, unbroken jar. I have a wallflower plug in, and I have a couple car refills. Now, after I left the candle store, I made my way over to Dollar Tree, and I bought some cute little jars for putting candles in. I'm going to take some of my broken wax. These are really nice. Four colors. They come in the blue, the yellow, the orange, and the red. Very fall colors. I got two of each color. So that'll be nice. It'll make nice gifts. I'll put them on my Etsy shop. And I've got two of the cutest little candle holders that I'm going to make candles out of. I've got two spiders. These are so cute that I just had to buy them. I'm going to put candles in them. I haven't decided what flavor is going to go in them yet, but if you want to leave me uh, in my comments your suggestion for what flavor to put in the candles, in the candle holders, let me know. I am open to suggestions. I've got a lot of flavors. I've got almost every flavor that they make. And then on my way out of the parking lot, I stopped at five below. I didn't really mean to stop there because I wasn't going to be picking up anything but candles and makeup anymore because my children told me I have too much stuff in my house and I need to clear it out. But I found another remote multicolor light strip, a tempered clear glass for the telephone and another phone case, of course. And a little keychain ball that lights up when it bounces. So here it is, my great Dollar Tree candle holder score and my Bath & Body Works score, full fresh candles, unbroken jars, aromatherapy, and wallflower plugins. Good haul, I would think so in two days. That gives me another, let's count the candles, Nineteen more candles. Okay. Good haul. I'm also going to take some candles, box them up. So anyone that's interested in buying a box full of candles, I'm going to take some from the broken jars that are full candles, never burnt, make a box of those. And then I'll make a box of partially burnt ones. And if anyone's interested in the little discs for Cutting up for wax melts, let me know. I can make a box of those too. Give you a good price, but I will have to charge for shipping because the boxes are fairly expensive to ship, as everyone knows. And candles are not cheap, they are heavy. So there it is. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please give me a thumbs up for like, and if you're not subscribed, Please be kind and subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a good day and be safe out there. 
And let's pray for those who are in the eye of the storm. And let's give a good prayer for Grizzly. Let's hope that he does better and has a good treatment plan so he can do better. Because you're all family and we love you all. So take care out there. See you later.